Welcome back, folks, to another episode of Bob's Holly World. Today, I am going to be doing another unboxing of these excavation kits. Um, I just did one previously, like immediately before I recorded this video. And that is why my hands are dirty, and that's why there's already clay in the background. This one is um, under the sea theme. The other one was uh, like an Egyptian theme. So it's cool. Again, it comes in this this neat chest, which I'm going to hold on to. I'm going to also hold on to this, this rope that it came with. It'll come in very handy with like uh, figures. Either it's like as a rope to tie somebody up or, you know, uh, a rope to climb or... So automatically this one, uh, clay mound is at the very begin at the top, followed by its tools, and then there's this this uh, tissue paper to I guess keep it from flopping around. Nothing else in the box. We'll put the box over there. We'll pull this up. Shout out to little Debbie Boston Cream Rolls. And um, I can see already that one of the pieces is very easily um, obtained. Unless, for some reason, this clay was rock hard. But yeah, it's right there. So, I'm not even going to open up the second toolkit. I'm just going to use the same toolkit. And I'm just going to dig around it. Dig, dig, dig. And yeah, it's a gem of some sort. And again, this is a toy. It's not of any value. Um, but these are Goodwill. For a dollar twenty-five, I think it's that yeah, it was on the plastic part, but yeah. And these came out, I guess, last holiday season. But they have an Easter theme, like there's bunnies and I forgot the other thing that was on it, but it's an Easter theme. So and it's like a purple gem. Just gonna go ahead and pop it in this water. I put the other pieces in there. That's the water I usually use to paint, but I haven't painted anything. And I just had the water prepared for when I do get ready to paint. So and this second piece is also pretty easy to get to. I don't want to break it. It's plastic, but still I don't want to risk breaking it. So I will dig more. And it's bigger than the other one. Might be the biggest piece I've encountered so far. And it's not super large. And it's just a pink stone. I think, um, yeah, and these say two pieces. Two hidden surprise treasures. So that might be it for this. I'm going to break them. Pretend. And now I'm not that strong. So bear with me. I was just about to say, hopefully the camera doesn't fall, but sure enough, it falls on the first strike. So, I just want to make sure there's nothing else in here. The seashell one is a little more lackluster, but it does say there's only two, and they were easy to get to. So, I should just take their word. This is not easy to penetrate. Yeah. Maybe down the line I'll I'll take this outside and just slam it on the ground. But I don't think there's anything else in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this. So like, comment, and subscribe. Actually before I do that, let me show you the five pieces. Bear with me, let me dry them off. I just did that because I didn't feel like dusting them off. one the first three pieces I pulled out were all from the um, excavation set and I just lost the rock so I'm only going to be showing you four pieces total I just dropped the one of the pieces I took out of the water so it's not a big deal Bear with me, almost done. All right, so here are our four pieces. 
that we have able to find. There's this gold piece. This is pretty cool. And then there's rock. This is an actual rock. And then these two plastic pieces that came out of the one we just did. And yeah, so I paid a dollar twenty-five. I think another two dollars and fifty cents for five little pieces like that. But you also get these. This chest and the rope are useful. But yeah, if I were a parent, I would not want to spend that on my kids. And it had to have been a lot more before it made it to Goodwill. So it's all up to you guys. Um, yeah, to me, it wouldn't be worth it. If I just like, oh, if I was a kid, like, oh, I really want this. And I was a parent, I'd be like, no, you're not getting it. And I am a parent, but so I'm used to telling my kids no to certain things. But that's it, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let everybody know where they can find me, your boy B.O.B. And that's right here at Bob's Holly World. And um, as I said in the other video, I upload every single day. Um, usually reviews. Uh, at least five times a week, but then every other Saturday, I mean every other Tuesday, there is a Civvy Soldiers, Spaceman, and Superheroes episode, and every Thursday is a retro review. So just come back, and then I do what's in the box whenever a package comes in the mail. So I'll see you guys next time. Again, let all the homies know where they can find Bob, and that's right here. See you next time.